So you guys, what is up? Welcome back. So today we are finally building my first PC. So I'm kind of just going to go through some of the basic stuff on building. I do have uh, my lovely Edgar for tech source to help me out with this. So pretty much all I'm like, so I got all the parts kind of in here, you see. So I'm kind of just going to build it and I'm just going to kind of like show you like some of the steps. Like I'm just going to like kind of show. It's not going to be a super long video, but we're going to get right into it. So yeah. So I just installed the CPU and that was the most stressful thing ever. Cause the guy in the video, so he said like, don't touch the motherboard in weird places. I might have earlier, but I kind of like, I don't know. But when I put it in, I was like so stressed, but it's in. I really hope this works. Like I really did. This means so much to me. So I did just install the RAM, which was a little less stressful, but still kind of stressful. But I think the next part we're doing is the SSD. So we just installed the M.2 chip, which I was actually kind of confused on because I thought it would have to be like the other way around. But we did get it on, so now we're on to the cooler. Um, but it actually came with thermal paste, which is actually really useful. Yeah, we're going to get onto it. So I just installed the CPU, and it was kind of sketchy tightening, you know, like all the nail, like all the things. So I tightened it, I think, just enough that like it doesn't like shake or wobble or anything. So I think that's good enough. I'm actually so thankful this video is a thing. Uh, shout out to Tech Sources. You no, know, everyone probably watching this video knows who Tech Sources is. Guys, uh, he's, he's, he's getting me through this. I know what we're doing next, but I gotta say, this is. I'm really stressed that it's not gonna work, but let's just hope. So I finally just put in uh, like the protector for the uh, motherboard things, and that was probably the most annoying thing out of the whole thing. I was like pushing it in now. I don't even know if it's in perfectly, but it's in. But yeah, no, that was horrible what I just had to do. So we got the um, motherboard installed with everything as you can see. The graphics card will go there, but that will be in later. I think we're gonna work on the fan configuration, whatever the hell it's called. So yeah, but the motherboard is in, which is kind of dope, so yeah. So now we call it like kind of this fan rack thing that's gonna go like right into there. We already installed the back fan right here. And then all we have left is to install this NZXT fan um, that came with the case because there's the bottom one down there. I'm planning on putting this one just right there or right there, probably right there though, just to, like kind of match, but yeah. Okay, so we got the double stack of thermal take fans right here, the RGB ones. And then we got our bottom fan down here. So this one is intake. These three are intake. And then these two right here are exhaust. This one is an RGB, but this one is. These two light up, this and this one doesn't. But yeah, so we got one, two, three, four, five fans, three RGB, two non. Um, but I think the NTXT fans are a bit better than these, but we're just gonna see how it works when the PC is like done. So I just installed the power supply, and there's so many cables, like from my fans, from all that. But I did get it in, which is nice, and everything's going hopefully well. Like I'm like, hoping this works because like i'm stressing that something's gonna go wrong because i've seen so many videos on it but we're gonna we're gonna keep on going and see where it goes so chat i ran into a lot of problems i didn't know that there was something called like a fan header so to connect most of these fans up here i need like a header and like the things and like some of the cables in here literally make no sense like so i was watching the uh, video and i don't need any of these cables none of them and it's like i'm kind of confused and also like the cable management on this thing's kind of annoying so i'm gonna take the risk and take a couple steps ahead but i don't know really what to do here but we're gonna try to figure it out so we just had like a whole nother problem with the cpu coming out and all this stuff and it's literally just been constant just hell now like, I feel like I'm missing things and I can't, like, I just don't know what to do. But I'm gonna keep on trying. So, since we're kind of just going ahead with it, we're gonna put in the graphics card kind of right here and then do a little bit of cable managing uh, just to figure it out and see if it works. If it doesn't, then I'll be very upset. But yeah, we're gonna try and see if this thing can work. I did order a fan hub so I can get more fans, but yeah, so yeah. So I finally put in the graphics card. I know this thing looks like a hunk of ugly mess, 
but hopefully it will be working soon. I mean, it's like I've been doing this for like five hours now. It's like nine o'clock. Um, but I hope, like, cause Sunday apparently the thing for the fans will come. So yeah, I'm gonna do the rest of the stuff. So I finally have everything set up and all this stuff. I don't think it's gonna turn on, even with the Wi-Fi. I got it plugged and turned on. If this turns on, I'll be surprised, but yeah, like I thought, it did not turn on at all. And it's plugged in. Oh my God. I'm like, does anyone wanna buy this off me? Like genuinely? Oh my god, it's def like definitely the CPU or something's broken. It looks like the motherboard's on, but I don't think that means the PC is. I don't know if that just lit up because the power supply. But I would have expected like the plugged in fans and the AMD Ryzen thing to work. It's in. Why won't you work? So chat, I've, or I just said chat. Uh, I'm like, it's like what? It's like 10, I can't show, like you can't see, but it's like 10 o'clock now. So I'm gonna take the whole thing apart and hopefully not break anything. I really think there's definitely just an issue with the motherboard. Um, Cause all the power connectors are connected. The motherboard was lit on. So I really just think it's a problem with the CPU. I feel like I broke the CPU. But I don't know yet. It could also be a problem with something else. Um, but I'm just gonna take it apart and then watch a different video because this guy didn't really help me with certain things. So yeah. So uh, we took apart the PC. Literally everything is just everywhere. We're gonna try to go again. Different video. It's gonna take hours, I know. But I. I'm destined for it to work, and if it doesn't work this time, then I probably have to send it to some guy who's gonna fix it or whatever. Uh, but it's kind of, it really does suck because I was like so excited that we're gonna go. It's like 10:30 right now, so we're gonna see how long it takes me to finish this. I'm not gonna give you guys any updates until I run into a big problem. So guys, I uh, did the whole thing again, and it works. Fans are blowing air. Now I know these two are only intake. The fan down here isn't working, but it turned on. So I'm gonna set it up and see how it goes. It's kind of exciting. All I have to do is pretty much just take it apart. But I mean, it works. After about 30 minutes of troubleshooting, we finally have it right here. It's working. It's finally on. The PC is holding up. We do not have the fans we need, but everything else is in, so I'm just gonna get into this and I'll tell you guys when I get set up. So, yo guys, I finally got the PC set up. Everything's in except in the fans because I gotta wait for the fan thing to come. It's not working. The only thing I have to do is do the internet, which is not working strangely, but we're gonna do it. But yeah, so I'm just gonna do that and I'll check back with you guys when I fix it. So Shad, that is for today's video. I did not figure out the internet, but I've been sitting here. It is now 1.37 p.m. or a.m. Like it's pitch black out. Uh, so I'm done with this. I just wanna say, there'll be like a setup tour thing like soon, just on like the PC being completely done with the rest of the fans and stuff. But for the next two days, I think I'm just gonna let it sit. I do need to figure out the internet thing though. Um, I'm gonna update you guys on that, but yeah, uh, this is what it looks like right now. It's kind of hard because of the reflection, but I've been doing this since like five, since 4.30 and now it's 1.30, so I even know the math on that, but it's done. But yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.